Larger selection, lower prices, smarter associates. H.H. Greg, we help. You can't find a better weather day today. This is Trace Jones getting ready. Travis Benjamin and Devon Johnston are back for Miami. And this is going to be Benjamin, one of the top kick return artists in the country, and he finds some room. And it's driven out of that one at the 28 yard line. This running offense, and there is to Corey Harris, the senior out of Miami. Northwestern High School, and he's got Mike James and Lamar Miller for him in the backfield. This is Miller. Tries to turn the corner. A block from James helped get him a couple of other deep backs now for North Carolina. Second down and sixth. Pass out to the wing. It's going to be Benjamin. He's got the first down and more out to the 45 yard line. And Robinson comes down to make the tackle. This is early in the game. Now, Golden, first year head coach here after six years at Temple. Here's Harris to throw. Pass complete. This is Benjamin. Benjamin steps up, finds some open running room. And finally, Robinson knocks him down with the 33 yard line. Catch to Mike James. He drops the snap. And is lucky to get back to the line of scrimmage and in fact picks up two yards to the 31. And keeping the offense on the field. Harris back to throw. Pass is complete out into the flats. It's going to be to Dorsett. Philip Dorsett, true freshman out of Fort Lauderdale. Nickel back in the game's going to miss the tackle. Again, just another little screen. They're going to, Dorsett's going to bubble out. Jacory reads the coverage now right there. Missed tackle right there by Tim Scott, the nickelback, and good running by Dorsett to get it up the field and extend this drive. Impressive opening drive for Miami. Miami is on the verge of popping into the red zone here. They've got a double tight end set this time around, and Miller is a setback. Harris, Miller in the flats. Coverage there. He'll get past the line of scrimmage and knocked out of bounds. That's a positive play by Jacory Harris. Second down and six. Miller, a workhorse, looks for a way and slips as he tried to reverse field. Critical game, meaning you got to defend sideline to sideline. They got Benjamin in a wildcat this time, and he gets down to about the 12, but he is shy of the first down, if only by a half yard. Tim Scott makes the tackle. That's the second time they've used that. This big offensive line for Miami come off. They've had to replace some players, done an excellent job of trying to keep some continuity up front. Good job by Benjamin to hit it up in there, go north and south. James is the running back for Ja'Cory Harris. Harris sprints out, fires. The pass complete to Benjamin. And he's going to be good for the first down at the 10 yard line. The first down. Good drive here formulated for the Hurricanes. Here's James probing his way through, and a nice surge to the five yard line. You know, moving the football has not been their problem. They scored the last four times they had the glory here in a no back set and score himself. Harris looking for Streeter. Oh, what an exceptional play by Charles Brown backed up in the end zone on Tommy Streeter. Well, Charles Brown does a good job of keeping inside leverage and then gets the eyes back to the quarterback, elevates and bats the ball down with the right hand. A little bit underthrown here from Jacory. He needed to get that to the back pylon to give Streeter an opportunity, but excellent play. There's a snap. Pass is complete. This is James. Touchdown, Miami. And the hurricane strikes quickly. Well, Steve, they may have gotten away with one here. This looks like there's an offensive lineman blocking downfield on this play when James catches the football in this little angle route. Let's look and see if he catches this ball behind the line of scrimmage. Looks like he's right at the tape, so he's probably legal. You see the block, 63. Tyler Horn, the center, so a nice little disguise there, almost a little middle screen on third down for the touchdown. Point after it is good. of the passing game, running game, screen game, which is an extension of your running game. Jacory was outstanding distributing the football. That's the kind of drive you want to set the tone. Al Golden certainly looking for that kind of drive from his team. And an offensive coordinator, Jed Fish, doing an outstanding job on that drive. He called two Wildcat plays, one with Travis Benjamin, the other with Mike James. Black cloud of kick. One of the top, if not the top, kick returner in the ACC, T.J. Thorpe has it. Thorpe gets a block and loses the football. It's picked up by Miami. T. 
T.J. Thorpe is still on the ground. Now he gets up slowly, but Miami's going to have the football back. Yeah, holding that arm, he was carrying the football in. Let's see where the hit comes. Thorpe, the number one returner in the ACC, oh, took a shot right on the football, and his forearm popped out. Of there, outstanding hit on the kick return. Look at that. There's Al Golden right in the mix. There he is, right here. Look at him. He's in the mix. Look at him. Quick change, fellas. Quick change. Nathan Golston is the man who caught the ball. In Steve, let's go back and look at this play. Jed Fish does a great job of designing this. This is Horn, the center. He's going to come out and get a block. Now, remember, the ball has to be caught behind the line of scrimmage. The line of scrimmage is at the five. Good, good job by James to stay behind the five, makes the block by Horn clean, ends up being a one-man middle screen. Really cool design there because it looked like drop back pass. Lamar Miller is in the backfield, and here's Ja'Cory Harris with a lot of lot of Miami territory behind him. He's in the Tar Heel in the side of the field at the 27-yard line. Great field position. After the fumble, here's Two double hitches to pass complete for the touchdown. That is touchdown Tommy Streeter. 27 yard two fake reverses in different directions drew the Tar Heel secondary away and Streeter was wide open in the end zone. Yeah, that's a good job. Good ball handling here. Going to fake the stretch play first. Fake the reverse to Benjamin. Safety's bit up looking in the backfield. That's what you hope. You hope that they're peeking in the backfield. You see the defenders close because they're peeking in the backfield and Streeter that's the kind you complete every day in the schoolyard. Here's Whiteclaw on again very quickly. And in less than seven minutes, Miami has scored two touchdowns on the Tar Heels. They do it off a turnover. Look at the play fake action here. Two fakes and a wide open Tommy Streeter. Miami leads here 14 to nothing. Jake Whiteclaw's kick and will be underway. Brown at the two. Brown gets hit in midair and he's brought down at the 13 yard line. Tackle made there by Fentress. Fans, get your cell phones ready. It's time for the ATTM fan book. He's got Giovanni Bernard behind him and he'll be in the passing mode and has to throw this one away. Regis puts the pressure on him. Mike Connor Regis. There's a host of Miami defenders in quick. This is a screen pass. They're trying to set up a screen to the left. And uh, you get beat right at the point of attack. Travis Bond got beat right away by Regis. They come out here with a 14 0 deficit, which happens to be their biggest deficit of the season so far. And the round. Back the other way. And this is Highsmith. Eric Highsmith. Pushes ahead and gets the ball outside the 30 yard line, and that brings the Tar Heel faithful to life here. Chickaloy on the tackle for Miami. It's a game over to Ken Holland this afternoon. And this is going to be Houston who gets the tackle or gets the play on the first play after the first down, and he'll get out to about the 40 yard line. A gain of seven. Stick to the defense now for Miami. That's for Al Golden's Miami Hurricane. 28 different Hurricanes have lined up on defense for Al Golden. Boy, it's been a shuffle the deck on the defensive side of the football. Second down and four. Renner to Highsmith, and not much room there. Making a nice play, Mike Williams. Williams. So he can play next week. Ninth rated in the ACC. Very uncharacteristic for Miami to be that low. Of course, they lost uh, Marcus Fortune, a defensive tackle, and Long Buchanan, a linebacker. This is Giovanni Bernard, the leading freshman ball carrier in the country. And he gets the first down. Out to the big, behind those big offensive linemen and finding the creases. Here's Renner. Get a first down. Play action. Pass comes out to Bernard. And Bernard. That's, a, that's Wilkins, I'm sorry. 6-2. Big, big safeties. Here's the pitch to Bernard. On the quick count, Bernard gets past midfield, gets to about the 48-yard line. And Jimmy Gaines had an excellent week against Virginia Tech, comes up with the tackle. Gaines with 32 tackles on the season. He's second to Sean Spence. Four-yard gain for North Carolina brings up third down for the first time this afternoon. And on the first play after the fumble, Miami scored again. Renner. 
steps up and incomplete. Intended that time to give season of 40.1. There's Travis Benjamin who's brought one back for a touchdown in his career. Good ball for the fair catch here, and it'll go into the end zone. Carolina will not be able to save the point. Into the flats to Benjamin. Darrell Lipford is there, along with Matt Merletti, to stop him at the 27 yard line, folks. And around this time, Benjamin gets it, turns the corner, out over the 30 yard line to about the 33. And Lipford is there, along with Robinson. First and 10. From the 33 of Miami. Harris out of the shotgun. Miller in motion. It's an open backfield. Pass right up the middle is knocked away, intended for Hearns. And that's Jordan Nix, the big defensive. Second down and 10. And he has two touchdowns. Here's Miller right through the middle. And he drags people with him, most notably. It's going to be number 93, two and three on third down. Eduardo Clements is the running back. This is his first appearance in the game today. Harris to throw. Pass is complete, and it's close to the first down, and they are going to mark him ahead of the first down marker. That's Walford. Clyde Walford, the back. Miami's had the ball. Good amount of this first quarter. 334 left. First and 10 at the 44. The pitch comes to Lamar Miller. There's a flag on the play, and Miller is thrown for a loss by Gene Robbins. For Miami, their worst down and distance of the day. Harris. They scramble out. We got a flag. The pass is incomplete. Intended for Cleveland. The line to get is the 46 of North Carolina. North Carolina didn't send anyone. Harris down the middle. He's got a man open for the first down. They can't get Streeter down. Good ticky tack right there. Wilson should have blown a little earlier. Here's Miller on the sweep. Gets about two yards. They move from the 28 down to the 26. Matt Milletti with his fourth tackle of the day. Preseason practice. Travis Hughes, the true freshman, is in there. Reddick's in there as well. Here's Lamar Miller fighting for yardage, and he'll get two, maybe three down to the 20. Create some problems when you have lesser experienced players in the field. Miami three or four on third down. They lead 14 to nothing. Harris to throw. Pass is dropped by Hearns, but it was right on the money. 39. This will be his longest of his career if he hits his 42 41 yarder. A little hold of Whipple. The kick is up. And it is good. So Miami Ur adds a third first quarter score. Two touchdowns and now a field goal for Al Golden's team at the 141 mark. A 41 yard field goal for Jake Wyclaw. Tremendous job. Wyclaw to kick. TJ Thorpe is back in the game and he's under this kick two yards deep. Coming up the same sideline where he got hurt on the turnover that set up. He has to go down and try to score on the board here. Giovanni Bernard that gets the play fake. Renner to throw. He just flushes him out of the pocket. The pass complete to Dwight Jones, and it's good for a first to give an angle for Renner to get him the ball. First and ten. Bernard picks his way through and will fall ahead for five yards. How about that? He said, Don't go that way. Second down and four. This is Houston. Ryan Houston gets the call. And North Carolina pushes it into Miami territory. He's done such a good job of winning. You have two offensive coordinators who have a lot of experience in the NFL. Here's Renner. The pass complete to Highsmith. And Highsmith gets about nine on the play, maybe eight out to the 36. Comes to the sideline. A great start for the Miami Hurricanes. They are determined to finish what they started. They put three scores on the board. They're up 17 to nothing through one at Chapel Hill.